I was just reading Twitter. People are, are there's like a lot of discourse around, uh, remember the Fable trailer and like the girl in the Fable trailer is ugly. Oh, f I mean, for a Fable game, like it, it guess she's ugly. Yeah. Why would they make, why would they make her so ugly? Why would they do? I don't understand. Like, I don't understand, I'll tell you this, right? I really don't understand the logic and like, why would you make it a super ugly character? Like, why would you put a really ugly character in, in the, the trailer? Like, it doesn't make sense. Like, nobody wants to look at an ugly person. Like, it doesn't make any, like, what are we doing? Like, she's not even ugly. She's extremely ugly. Like, let's, why are we pretending? She looks disgusting. Like, imagine, imagine if the trailer the bo the main character was like a fat fucking neckbeard brony with a with glasses and like uh, a tied back ponytail and he's bald on the top of his head he has like a hair hairstyle like me but he's like 350 pounds and he can barely fit his armor on it's like it would look ridiculous it would be stupid like nobody wants to see that stop it it's so off-putting and weird that you would make such a weird ugly looking character the main character of the story. I would assume that a lot of the marketing for Diablo 4 probably doesn't show the really ugly looking male necromancer without a shirt on. And that's because they want people to buy the game. Because nobody wants to buy a game that you can, you, you, you play the game and you look like a fentanyl addict. Yeah, they literally got Megan Fox advertising the game. Yeah, of course they did. And it was a great idea. To be fair, every Fable character looks like the average UK resident. Let me see what the Fable box. That's a good looking dude. That's also a good looking dude. What that is, yeah, I mean, come on. What are we talking about here? They initially made her uglier. Yeah, nothing says female inclusion like making them ugly. <laughs> so fucking ridiculous. What a world we live in. Oh my God, let's see.